away from the anatomy and physiology of the thyroid gland uh, we'll be making different videos on the blood supply to the thyroid gland and the nervous supply to the thyroid gland uh, the, the blood drainage of the thyroid gland and the lymphatic drainage of the thyroid gland okay so if you guys are with me then let's proceed this is the mbbs niger kindly do subscribe to our youtube channel if you haven't so our focus is uh the lymphatic drainage of the thyroid gland all right lymphatic drainage of the thyroid gland okay so you could see uh how many types of uh, lymph nodes can you actually uh identify from here you see these are the paratracheal lymph nodes uh the lower deep cervical lymph nodes the upper deep cervical lymph nodes the pre laryngeal lymph nodes and the pre tracheal lymph nodes all right and from the way we see now these things here is like okay some lymph nodes are draining the thyroid gland directly okay then after draining into some other larger groups of lymph nodes right so this lecture will help you guys arrange this knowledge in your head okay so the lymphatics from the thyroid gland will empty into the deep cervical lymph nodes, right? So if we're having upper deep cervical lymph nodes and lower deep cervical lymph nodes, it means that both the upper and the lower deep cervical lymph nodes will receive lymph nodes, okay, from the thyroid gland, okay? So, um, from the deep cervical lymph nodes, these lymphs will continue to drain into the thoracic ducts on the left, okay and on the right side it's a drain into the lymphatic duct on the right i don't know if you understand on the left is to a specific lymph node called the thoracic duct while on the right is the right lymphatic duct okay so the thoracic duct will further now empty into the left venous angle formed by the left internal jugular vein and the left subclavian vein Okay, so I hope you guys understand. But I feel like this lecture was like, uh, it started like halfway, all right? That's why I brought these pictures for you guys. So now you should note. Draining the thyroid gland directly is the pre-laryngeal lymph nodes, which are these ones in orange, the pre-tracheal lymph nodes, which are these ones in red, and the what? Paratracheal lymph nodes, which are these ones in purple on both sides, all right? So, these three lymph nodes now, they will drain to the superior deep cervical lymph nodes and the inferior deep cervical lymph nodes. Or in other words, we could say the upper deep cervical because upper means superior, lower means inferior, okay? So, this whole story now started from these deep cervical lymph nodes, all right? So, from the deep cervical lymph nodes, it goes to the thoracic duct on the left and the right lymphatic duct on the right. Okay, so the thoracic duct now will go further to empty into the left venous angle, which is formed by the left internal jugular vein and the left subclavian vein. All right, so this is a beautiful story, and I hope you guys understood it. All right, if you did, kindly do like this video and see you guys in the next one.